If I had to put money on it, I'd say that Nigel Farage is going to win the debate. Um, and it's, if he does, it's because he's got the best arguments, I think, on the question of European democracy and sovereignty, and also on economics and the, uh, the logic of the EU, if you like, and the dangers of the EU. Um, I don't think he'll win because he'll be the best prepared, because he is, in my experience, singularly averse to preparing for anything. And so that's where Clegg has a chance, because I'm sure he's got a big professional team behind him, uh, coming up with good lines, finding new lines of uh, uh, arguments and so on that might surprise um, Farage. But in a way that tells us a lot about the difference between the two politicians. Clegg is a professional politician, Farage is, uh, is averse to all of those little tricks. And in a sense that's the basis of his popularity. So although he's at a disadvantage, that he doesn't, that he's not going to spot up beforehand. At the same time, you know, that's his charm.